And welcome, dear friends, to another edition of Fresh Bread. This is Reverend Phil Anderson here, pastor of Oakland United Methodist Church and Kansas Avenue United Methodist Church, welcoming you to another week of broadcast. You know, this is a very special week, one of my very favorite weeks of all the year. It truly is. So this is Thanksgiving week. You know, Thanksgiving is celebrated on the fourth Thursday of November each year, and so this particular week is just a great week. You know, the kids are only going to school for a couple of days. They have some time off. We, many of us are looking forward to having people come over to our homes. And maybe if you're not able to do that, I'm hoping you'll be able to share a meal with somebody else. It's just a great time of the year to just enjoy the goodness of God, just to take that time to be thankful, which we should do every day, right? But here's the chance today to really just give God that special thanks that he deserves on this coming Thursday, November the 25th. I want to remind you that we will be having a Thanksgiving Eve service, and that'll be at 6 p.m. on Wednesday, November 24th, 2021, at Kansas Avenue United Methodist Church. And it's going to be a great service. I really hope you can take a few minutes out of your busy schedule. I know everybody's busy. But it's nice to take that little break. It just gets us kind of reoriented and gets us centered. And so I invite you to come and be a part of that service again at 6 p.m. Wednesday for our Thanksgiving Eve service at Kansas Avenue United Methodist Church. And, of course, that's at 1029 North Kansas Avenue. And we will only keep you there for about 45 minutes to an hour. We won't be make it a real long service. I know everybody's going to be getting their last minute preparations done. And I just look forward to this time of year. I really do. And this kind of starts out the Christmas season. And, you know, just think this year Christmas is exactly one month from Thanksgiving. Doesn't happen very often like that, does it? Just thought of that. But Thanksgiving is on November 25th. And, of course, Christmas is on December 25th, as, of course, you know. Well, you know, I'm just going to take these moments here today just to visit with you about a few things. And we looked at some scripture passages last week. We'll look at a few more even today as we just, again, celebrate the goodness of God. I want to read this verse of the day today found in Psalm 119 and verse 105. Thy word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Oh, how true that is. The Word of God, simply put, is our lifeline. It is what brings us oxygen and water and food and rest and shelter and clothing. If you were to look at the blessings that God gives us spiritually in a more of a physical sense, the Word of God, I believe, is what delivers all of that to us in a very tangible way. Because when we are in the Word of God, we are going to get everything that we need. Just like you would get everything you need for your body through your food, your clothing, your shelter, your water, the oxygen that you breathe. All of these things are vital to you living physically. Well, just as the different elements of our physical world help sustain us in our daily lives... So does the Word of God sustain us in our spiritual lives. And I'm going to tell you something, friends. If we don't get in the Word of God, that's on us. There is no excuse. And I don't care whether it's just reading one verse. You know, you may say, you know what, I don't have time, Pastor Phil, to read anything. Well, you know what, you can read one verse, and I know that we can all do that. So I pray that's what you do this week. Hey, we'll be back tomorrow for more fresh bread. Until then, may God richly bless you as my prayer. Have a great day.